In this video, we take a deep dive into the life of Kim Jong-un, the enigmatic and controversial supreme leader of North Korea. Despite this substantial wealth, Forbes does not include Kim in its annual list of the world's wealthiest individuals, thus providing no specific estimate of his wealth. However, Forbes does rank Kim as the world's 36th most powerful person. Previously, Kim's late father, Kim Jong-il, was listed by Forbes as the 37th most powerful person in the world. Investigations have revealed that a significant portion of Kim Jong-un's wealth is stored in over 200 foreign bank accounts spread across countries such as Austria, Liechtenstein, Russia, Singapore, China, Switzerland and Luxembourg, among others. The bulk of these accounts, containing hundreds of millions of dollars in cash, are situated in China, North Korea's closest ally. It is suspected by investigators that some of Kim's wealth stems from North Korea's resources, including the production of illicit drugs, illegal ivory trafficking, alcohol production, counterfeiting the US dollar, and manufacturing counterfeit cigarettes. While Kim's net worth has likely increased since 2013, the lack of recent data hinders an accurate estimation of his current wealth. Hence, Kim's wealth continues to be widely cited at $5 billion. There exists some ambiguity regarding Kim Jong-un's exact age, as various sources cite conflicting birth years. The US Treasury Department listed his birth date as January 8, 1984, while other sources claim 1983 as his birth year. Kim Jong-un attended an elite boarding school in Switzerland, where he adopted a westernized lifestyle under the alias Pak Un, shielded from global scrutiny. His abrupt departure from the school at around the age of 17 suggests a return to Pyongyang. According to some reports, Kim Jong-un has personally ordered the execution of approximately 340 people since assuming power in 2011. Among those executed, approximately 140 were high-ranking officials within the government, military, and the ruling Korean Workers' Party. Notably, Kim Jong-un's uncle was executed for treason via firing squad, a punishment described by state media as befitting a traitor for all ages. Kim Jong-un reportedly spends between $650 million and $700 million annually to maintain a lavish lifestyle importing luxury goods, from top-shelf liquor to ski jets. One of Kim's most extravagant possessions is a 195-foot, 60 meters luxury yacht costing $7 million, equipped with twin water slides, an Olympic-sized pool, and a multi-story lounge. His opulent chambers are stocked with the finest wines and spirits, ensuring a constant flow of luxury within his domain. He spends $35 million on an unused ski resort. The construction of Masikryong Ski Resort is estimated to have cost approximately $35 million, though some sources suggest the bill exceeded $100 million, and it was erected from the ground up in less than a year. However, the resort largely remains unused, as the majority of North Korea's population struggles with poverty and tourism within the country is minimal. Though the extent of his involvement in the sport remains largely undisclosed, Kim Jong-un has fostered an image of being an avid basketball fan. One of the most notable instances of his interest in the sport was his reported friendship with former NBA player Dennis Rodman. Rodman famously visited North Korea multiple times and even organized exhibition games featuring other former NBA players. Kim Jong-un is known to be a fan of the Chicago Bulls team and idolizes Michael Jordan's basketball prowess. This admiration for Jordan's skills has been exploited in North Korean propaganda to portray Kim Jong-un as a well-rounded leader with an interest in Western culture despite the country's isolationist policies. Kim Jong-nam, his half-brother, appeared to be the successor, but his aspirations seemingly came to a halt in 2001. During that year, Kim Jong-nam was apprehended sneaking into Japan on a fake passport to visit Tokyo Disneyland. Following this incident, Kim Jong-nam was seemingly sidelined and lived in exile until his demise in Kuala Lumpur. On February 13, 2017, 
Kim Jong Nam was poisoned with the VX nerve agent while traversing Terminal 2 of Kuala Lumpur International Airport. Under Kim Jong Un's leadership, North Korea has aggressively pursued the development of its nuclear program, resulting in heightened tensions with the international community. Recent reports indicate advancements in North Korea's hypersonic missile program, demonstrating a commitment to developing more sophisticated weaponry capable of reaching distant targets. In 2021, Kim Jong-un declared intentions to modernize the military, unveiling plans for the development of advanced weapons systems, including hypersonic missiles. These efforts signify Pyongyang's determination to enhance its military capabilities, potentially posing a threat to regions farther afield, such as Guam, a U.S. territory. According to data from the Arms Control Association, as of 2021, the United States possesses approximately 5,550 warheads, trailing Russia by approximately 700 warheads. In comparison, North Korea's arsenal is estimated to comprise only 40 to 50 warheads. To surpass the US in nuclear capabilities, Kim Jong-un would need to significantly increase North Korea's stockpile by producing over 5,000 additional nuclear warheads. He possesses a private island where his villa is outfitted with luxurious amenities, including cruise ships, a marina, a horse riding range, a shooting range, a water play area, and numerous other splendid entertainment facilities. In 2013, Dennis Rodman, a former basketball player from the United States, was invited there twice in February and September as Kim showcased his opulent recreational facilities. Rodman, who experts claim has had more contact with the North Korean leader than any other American, described the island resort, likening it to the Spanish island Ibiza. The lavish lifestyle enjoyed by the Kim family stands in stark contrast to the living conditions endured by the majority of North Koreans, who struggle to make ends meet in an economy ravaged by international sanctions and prolonged trade disruptions with China due to the COVID-19 pandemic. At the age of 27, he underwent plastic surgery with the intention of resembling his grandfather. While most individuals choose plastic surgery to address facial imperfections or enhance their features, Kim Jong-un, the 27-year-old heir to the North Korean regime, opted for surgery to emulate his grandfather's appearance. Evidence supporting this claim may not be definitive, but his photographs taken over the years suggest alterations, particularly noticeable in his eyebrows it is speculated that he deliberately altered them to resemble his father, Kim Jong-il. Kim Jong-un reportedly travels with a personal toilet wherever he goes, even when abroad. This portable toilet is essential for maintaining the confidentiality of his health status, as information gathered from his excretions is considered sensitive and cannot be left unattended. The presence of a portable toilet prevents any possibility of dedicated sewer divers gaining access to insights about the Supreme Leader's health. Rumors suggest that Kim Jong-un avoids using regular toilets out of concern that his waste could be intercepted by unauthorized individuals. Concerns regarding Kim Jong-un's health have sparked widespread speculation. Reports suggest he has experienced weight gain and mobility issues, possibly attributed to an unhealthy lifestyle characterized by indulgence in fine spirits and wines. His health is reportedly impacted by diabetes and hypertension due to a lack of physical activity. Some have warned that he is a heart attack waiting to happen. Allegedly undergoing a midlife crisis, Kim Jong-un is deeply troubled by his health status. Reports claim he weighs over 300 pounds, struggles with insomnia, and engages in alcohol and tobacco abuse, reminiscent of health issues that afflicted his late father. His increasing body weight has drawn attention, with some attributing it to his fondness for Swiss cheese, while others suggest it's a deliberate effort to resemble his grandfather. The Supreme Leader is a chain smoker with a taste for expensive cigarette brands despite the anti-tobacco laws introduced in the Hermit State. The irony was not lost on people living in the hermit state, given Kim has been pictured on numerous occasions with an expensive cigarette in his hand, who is spending $20,000 in expensive brand cigarettes per year. Kim holds the titles of General Secretary of the Workers' Party of Korea, the main leader of the Democratic People's Republic of Korea, 
the leader of the party and the people. Other titles are The New Start and The Genius Among Others. He is also a member of the Presidium of the WPK Politburo, the highest decision-making body in the country. In July 2012, Kim was promoted to the highest rank of Marshal in the Korean People's Army, consolidating his position as Supreme Commander of the Armed Forces. North Korean state media often refer to him as respected comrade Kim Jong-un or Marshal Kim Jong-un. Besides, he has two degrees, one in physics from Kim Il-sung University and another as an army officer at the Kim Il-sung Military University. Despite international condemnation of his authoritarian regime, Kim Jong-un has successfully cultivated a cult of personality within North Korea, further solidifying his grip on power. Despite being depicted as a deity-like figure in North Korean state propaganda, the truth behind Kim Jong-un's rule is one of fear and oppression. Behind the carefully crafted facade lies a leader who maintains control through coercion and intimidation, far removed from the image projected to the outside world.